Hello, everyone. My name is Death Tech, and we're continuing with Bastion. Um, yeah, we're continuing. I didn't even put the core back last time. <laughs> it ain't too late Silly to me. unlock the potential of this place. Uh, we're continuing with Bastion, and it's gonna be great. I don't know what to upgrade next, so I'm gonna go with, uh, the, uh no. This place, Lost and Found. I can't upgrade. Oh, I can't. There you go. We need an awful big lost and found under the circumstances. Uh, I love that statement. Of course. Oh. Uh, I love how it says for a certain weapon with a hammer. It doesn't say anything else. But why? Oh wait, it's not. What? Burnt. I, I read blunt. My bad. What's this for? Yay, no idea. Still some weapons out there. I have no idea what they are. Gain some health by counter-blocking with a bullhead shield. That's actually really useful. Gain some health by striking foes. Man, I don't care about health tonic potency if I can get health by hitting them. It wasn't yes. fixed. It was unbroken. Whoa. I, I saw something else good down here. Wait a second. 5% chance to turn Zealous after defeating a foe, while Zealous gain 200% damage per second. I thought I read something else. That was really good. Never mind. I might swap this one out for what I just bought. Yeah. That's gonna be so helpful. It will prevent. It'll effectively prevent me from needing to use the health tonics if I can just leech, leech health off so of them. sour, it'll perk you right up when you're feeling low. What else is there to say? Uh, come here, you little cutie. Follow daddy. All right. Oh, I'll leave him here. Don't the shards in. are getting harder to find. I finally have a ch Oh no, I thought I had a choice, and then it's... it's Put it away. They're all proving grounds. And I get, I get something quite good for completing these, but they're so hard. I don't wanna. Right, we'll do this one. I actually did the last episode in record time. It, I, I impressed myself. That was only Not 13 minutes. Blew up in the calamity. I think we're about to find something fiery. Why Colford Cauldron here blew up way ahead of its time. Sorry, uh, I get distracted. The cauldron boiled over some 300 years ago. They say it filled the skies with ash and the lakes with molten rock. I wonder if uh, life steal. If to survive something like that, uh, if uh, to learn to adapt. I wonder. I'm, I'm just gonna stand here and take some damage for a second. I don't know where this is coming from. Oh, there it's coming from. Yeah, damage over time does heal me. That is so useful. Oh my god. That's possibly the most useful tonic I can imagine. Especially because I rely on damage over time. Mainly. Primarily. Damage over time is my one trick pony. So the more enemies I hit, the more. I get like a health regen. So in a way, the beasts of the wilds, they're all survivors too. 
There we go. Just keep hitting that guy. I haven't lost any health. Right, guys? Right. You couldn't tell otherwise, right? I mean, the, the, the damage over time, definitely my favorite, along with uh, lifesteal. That works with the damage over time. That's just like the perfect thing. They're done. It takes a certain stubborn pride to keep on living in a place like this. Yeah, I, I agree with that. Almost like my type of stubborn. Eh. As for us, we learned an awful lot from Colford Cauldron. Nope. 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 Nope, I know where to go, damn it, game. Doesn't mean I want to yet. I think I'd have to break through this if I... Even still, if I had uh, touched a thing, but I'm about to have a fight when touching a fire bellows, whatever it is. I think I'm about to lose my bow again. That learning led to some interesting inventions. The raw power of the world fell right into our hands. Wow. Useless. I want my machete back. Oh, there's a heat bar. That's what I was doing wrong. My bad. That. Whatever the hell that was. Well, I just like straight on leaped off of the cliff. I really love the uh, damage over time lifesteal. Will you please fuck off? Whatever you are. Jesus. There's like something blocking my way and I can't even see it. <laughs> Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Wow, uh, I think I'm going to kill some more bones. That's how much they give me. <coughs> I should have been killing these bones all along. That's like the extra cash. Damn. I think I missed a whole bunch of cash back there. Damn. Can I go back? I can go back. It's fine. It's fine. I can go back. I'm gonna pick up all of this extra cash. Because that's how you win in games, ladies and gentlemen. By having all the extras you can get. People always go like, it's optional to do this. No, it's not. It's what you need to win the game. Whoops. Did I smash your face into sure, a shield? We dusted off a good many secrets out here. There we go. Just checking there's nothing I can burn. But we discovered other things we're better off not knowing. Oh man, I love that so oh, much. The unforgiven scent of sulfurous dirt. I swear, like, this tonic is the best thing ever. Please don't do that again. I came in like it. What is this thing even called? Oh, I don't know. It's... The taste of air is so hot it sticks to your lungs. That's what? The taste of hot 
Did, did you really say that? Because I'm pretty sure that's not a thing. Uh, actually, well, maybe spicy stuff. But not like that. Uh, that sounds weird. Who talks like that anyway? Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Stop wasting my time by making me wait here to not take damage from those things. It's so annoying. Stop it! All sorts of awful things crawling underfoot. Come on. God damn it, I forgot I can't throw my machete. I ain't got no machete. I'm gonna slowly heal up by doing this. Stop it. Stop it. Got another one of these. I fucking hate those things. There we go. Something else down there. Yeah, that's what I thought. Another one of those things. I hate those things. What is that? Dragon egg? Who knows? I prefer a machete. You know, machete can hit as much as you want. You don't need to reload. You don't need to wait for some stupid cooldown. It's so annoying. But naturally, this guy's natural reaction to being in a really hot, fiery, volcanic place is set everything on fire. Never thought we'd find so much life in all that ash. That's what the more ash we swept though. aside, the more life we found. That, that's that's what life does, though. Life adapts to whatever situation you fucking give it. So yeah. Why would you be surprised to find them down here? And was there a different way to go down here? I think there was. Uh, hi there, Mr. Ha, Mark. I, I thought I heard another one of those things. Pointing. We kept on sifting through the cauldron secrets anyway. Well, yeah, here's the arsenal. Why wouldn't I go to the arsenal? Because this thing sucks. Okay? It sucks. Machete. Yeah! Love my machete. Unless I can somehow, like, increase the amount of time I can hold down that fire bellows, I think it's called. Uh, there's really no desire for me to use that thing. The place is inhospitable as they come. Hi. Stop blocking me! God damn it! there's nothing it's more annoying than being stuck in the same spot. Thank you. Why can I only break some of these in a certain angle? It's very, very weird and meticulous. Oh no. Just stop that bullshit right now. Stop it. Stop it. Whatever is over there. Yeah, as much as I hate to say it, the fire bellows is very good at destroying these bones. But I'll just have to machete it. After all, when we look down inside Colford Cauldron. Come on.
There we go. Nope. Nope. Didn't even stand a chance. I love how that upgrade just made this so easy. All the smoke and flames. The health regen is amazing. I don't know if there's a limit to it. We saw in there the heart of the world. The heart now laid bare by the calamity. I think I only get like one health per hit or something stupid like that. So being able to do damage over time definitely helps with that. Point in case. How did that still hit me? I had my shield up. Now all these green things are gonna fuck me up. We had to have it. As for the kid, he just has to get that shard out of there. Too bad taking that thing woke up every last stink eye from here to Jawson Bog. Yep. But they can't move as long as I'm looking at them, so what do I care? Right? There we go. Hit all of them. Kid's thinking he's got to trek all the way back around the cauldron. That's... Uh, no. You're going to stop that right now. What you're doing over there, I don't know, but you're going to stop that. How would I even get there? How? How's that useful in any way? Uh... Luckily, the cauldron cooked up a little shortcut for him. Nice. Thank you, cauldron. Sure, it ain't the most convenient path. There we go. I love how, even though I take a, a chance and, uh... Uh-oh. Yeah, I, I'm, I don't seem to be losing any health. <laughs> I love it. I, oh, bye, Mark. There's no way to get, oh, I don't need to go over there. Never mind. Uh-oh. Biggest stink guy he's ever seen is waiting for him on the other side. Pops open on him like a pimple on a school Oops. day. Who cares? Wait, what did you just say? Pops open on him like a pimple on a school day. What? I don't even need to explain the kinds of messed up that is. You resist my arrows. And where there's one stink eye, there's always more. I love how fighting these is like kind of pointless to a degree. It's like I hit them once and they heal me back up. Like they, they, they can't even hurt me. The cauldron's tenants all gather up to bid the kid a fond farewell. I bet they do. There's one right there. I don't know if you can see it. What is it? Why is it not? There we go. I'm getting hit now. Kid, don't shed any tears for him, though. I've barely seen me lose any health throughout this whole ordeal. Uh, 
<laughs> oh my god, this is so much easier. Why is it not killing him? Die already! There we go. Here, please, uh... Die? Whoa, that one went flying! <laughs> you see them flying! You just imagine somebody being like in the other side, like, Where the fuck did that come from? Getting all pissed off. That'd be hilarious. With a good spyglass, you can still see the cauldron from the city. Oh, I can actually build all one. The fires died out. There's nothing left of it. I can actually build a uh, looking glass, I think, if I remember correctly. Try completing vigils in the memorial if I'm low on cash. He comes back looking like the inside of a chimney. The inside of a Really? I, I, I don't see the resemblance. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. The shard works like a charm. You can hear the monument's heartbeat again. Oh, you hear a heartbeat. It's alive! Like Frankenstein's monster. Let's uh, unlock some more challenges. The memorial may be finished, but our part is far from over. Oh my god, there's so many challenges. Take 20 foes with one continuous attack without taking damage. How the fuck do you do that? I can do that easy. You put 12 bullets in a single foe without missing. <laughs> Get to level 5. Okay then. Throw a trip to who knows where with at least one shrine idol active. So I'm gonna do that one. I'll turn on one of the shrines again. Shrines idol idols. We're all a little short on friends these days, <gasps> so that's a welcome sight. It's like a pigeon. Hello. Oh, where are you going? Wait, where are you going, friend? Oh, come back. Kid arrives just in time to sample Zia's famous no, cooking. No, no, please, no. I have a feeling there's gonna be more memories, and that's gonna be like some hard-ass shit. Gotta watch your fingers around that little guy. Oh. No? No? Okay. Team bull and fly. I, I'm enjoying that way too much. I'm sorry. <laughs> they said the wild could never be tamed. If only they could see us. Oh now. yeah. Uh, it, it took something to force people to go out the wilds to show that they can't be tamed. Just saying. Stop. Anything in the mailbox? Nope. Still no mail. Damn. I've been waiting for that registration form for that website for ages. Anyway, <laughs> thanks for watching, you guys. Please comment, rate, and subscribe if you feel like it. I will see you guys in the next video. Enjoy.